Hi everyone, Udi from Commodore here, and I'm super excited to meet you all at Salt Lake City this coming KubeCon. We have so many new and exciting things to share with the world, so come meet me and the rest of the Commodore team at the booth R9. At Commodore, we're building the Kubernetes management platform of the future. Our mission is to make Kubernetes at scale manageable. Um, how we do it? By simplifying every aspect of your Kubernetes platform, from daily operations and access control to troubleshooting and cost optimization. We just recently unveiled our AI agent, Claudia, that's capable of actually delivering correct and precise root cost analysis in less than 15 seconds. And that's only the beginning. As Kubernetes becomes more ubiquitous and the ecosystem and community continue to grow, so does Commodore's platform. We have taken our ability to detect, investigate, and remediate and prevent any Kubernetes issue and extended it to go deep and wide across the entire Kubernetes state, including native support for CRDs, and cluster add-ons. And if you come see us at KubeCon, we will definitely expand on it and show you what it truly means and to see it in action. Other than that, uh, like every other year, we're giving out our notorious swag, T-shirts, stickers, socks, Funko Pops, and more. We'll also be raffling an Apple Watch and a Nintendo Switch. And for the extremely lucky, one of you will get to go home with the famous Captain Kubernetes shield. So stay tuned, uh, see you there, and can't wait for KubeCon 2024. Hello, everyone. My name is Ajay Khanna. I'm the Chief Marketing Officer at Mesmo. Mesmo offers telemetry pipeline to collect, profile, transform, and route data uh, to any observability platform. And we also offer log management for search analysis and visualization. I'm very excited to join this year's KubeCon in Salt Lake City. I look forward to meeting people, learning from peers, and getting updates on progress and adoption of standards like open telemetry. On November 12th at KubeCon, we will be announcing some exciting updates about the Mesmo platform, which really enhances developer and SR experience for controlling and utilizing telemetry data. I welcome you to connect with us at Observability Day on November 12th, or visit our booth R16 during KubeCon for a live demo of our newest offering. So stop by our booth, try our new offering, and share your feedback. Our product team is uh, eager to hear from you. We are also hosting an observability uh, happy hour at STK on Thursday, November 14th at 4.30 p.m. So hope to see you there. Safe travels. So you're going to Salt Lake City for KubeCon. Have you started planning your schedule yet? Hi. I'm Michelle Yokura from Marantis, and I'd like to invite you to meet our team at KubeCon in booth R22. Who are we? We provide truly open and flexible container solutions that help you boost agility and smoothly scale out in production. We're proud to be the only independent company included in this year's Gartner Magic Quadrant for container management. This year at KubeCon, we'll be unveiling the next generation of Marantis Kubernetes Engine, our enterprise container platform that simplifies Kubernetes operations with automated management and robust security out of the box, including FIPS validated encryption modules. We'll also be showcasing the latest releases of open source projects that we lead, including k our lightweight CNCF certified Kubernetes distribution with zero dependencies, and Cosmotron, our open source multi-cluster manager. 
Mirantis is super excited to be sponsoring KubeCon again this year, and we look forward to meeting you in booth R22, where we'll be giving away Bose headphones and cool t-shirts. See you in Salt Lake City. If you ever wonder why the popularity of authorization, and in particular fine-grained permissions, has grown for the last couple of years, let me tell you about three reasons. The first one is the amount of data that we are processing. Our application amount of data is growing exponentially, and particularly the unstructured data of LLM applications became a real challenge to streamline and manage fine-grained permissions across all that. We don't want the users to get the data that they not, they not need to, and we don't want to break functionality of data that our users need to get access to. The second is the velocity that we want to ship our application. We don't want to broken our permission model, and we want to make sure that every delivery has streamlined permissions that you never break. And the third, and maybe the most important one, is the user requirement. Users are understanding security, they want to own their data, they are aware about data privacy, and they require fine-grained permissions to be implemented in our application. In Permit.io, we understand that authorization is not something that you plug and play your application. We know that it requires to understand the business model, the business need, and this is why we are developing a full-stack platform that will shorten the time you need to develop fine-grained authorization in your application. By using policy engines like Open Policy Agent, AWS Cedar, and OpenFGA, we are let you create one streamlined model for your permissions in a low-code editor UI, and then let you run it as a sidecar in your application, getting better fine-grained authorization for your needs. I'm inviting you to join us at Booth Q60. We are eager to learn from the users what they think about fine-grained authorization, how do they solve the problem, and how can we help you to implement it better. The cloud native ecosystem gives us a great advantage because it let you implement fine-grained authorization only in the way your application needs. Join us at BootQ60 for the activity, the raffles, and the swag, and also tell us what you think about fine-grained authorization. Hi there, my name is Asi Budani. I'm the CEO of Rafi Systems. At Rafi, we help enterprises and service providers speed up their cloud-native as well as AI journeys by addressing their infrastructure needs as it relates to platform engineering. The big challenge we're seeing in the market is that platform engineers now have to not only solve for the cloud-native journey for the company, which primarily consists of Kubernetes management and operations, they also now have to solve for the ML platforms in the company as well as management of GPUs. With Rafi, customers can bring both their cloud-native journeys and their AI journeys together into a singular platform, deliver a platform-as-a-service experience to developers and data scientists, give them self-service consumption of compute, along with pipelines for deployment of applications, plus AI ML workbenches, so that they can carry out jobs such as inferencing, fine-tuning, etc., plus build co-pilots and agents on top.